24 hour was a blast. We are now in the Tucson airport getting ready to fly to launch the MOG, NB's gravel bike. Um, where are we going, Avery? We are going to Los Angeles, Catalina Island. We're out here in Salina Beach, California to launch the new gravel bike from NB, the MOG. The weather has turned out to be a little bit interesting, but we're gonna see what we can do out here in the midst of this windstorm. I'll report back later. <laughs> we just want to make we just want to make things and do things. This is all the in between that no one ever sees. We got bikes. We're in LA now. Everything's falling apart. More on that later. So we're about to head out on the first ride with uh, with media to test the MOG out. Um, we're gonna ride a lot of the Belgian Waffle Ride course, uh, about 55 mile route. Rip around some rowdy sections, some road sections. Try to avoid the wind, and Avery's gonna follow along. Yes, I've been promoted to van dweller, photo taker, video, carrier. Yeah, connoisseur, food hauler. We'll see. The guy. You're promoted, you're promoted to the guy. the guy. It's very windy, so bear with this us. This is a gutter that fell off last night. It's been crazy here. We're mogging. I hope you like mogging too. Okay, I am uh, now in the Envy Man. I've been promoted to uh, everything guy photo taker, gear hauler. I'm going to follow these guys along the route in the van. Try to get a little bit of content and we'll see how things go. Here we go. If it's all right, oh, yeah. I wanna kick it with you all night, all night. Woo. Have a good time. Yeah. Ain't gotta worry cause it's all right, it's all right. All night, all night, all night. Oh yeah. Hey Alexi. Ooh. It's insane how quickly we pivoted from Catalina Island that there's actually a route that we're riding that's planned and we're not lost yet. For reference, 48 hours ago we were supposed to be in Catalina Island, big storm rolled in, and now we're in Solano Beach and Jess Sarah is leading us on a ride and we're about to take the road less traveled beside the road that's traveled a lot. Here we go. Welcome to California. <laughs> you dick. <laughs> Hey! If it's alright, I wanna kick it with you all night, all night. Have a good time. Ain't gotta worry, cause it's alright, it's alright. All night, all night, all night, baby. Don't be shy, don't be shy. Avery's here! This feels familiar. This is Belgian Waffle Ride territory. Uh, just, I have a lot of PTSD just like flew out of my body because it was so much more fun on a gravel bike than a road bike. <laughs> he has custom kit already. I know. Look at this. Goodness. I talked to Steve and he said he couldn't get me done because he had you. That's what he said. It's, He's a, like, big ben, it's, a, it's a big order. It's a big order. Tall order. <laughs> it's a tall, big old wide order. Uh, yeah, we are out at Lake Hodges. We are pre-riding. Belgian Waffle Ride course, right Avery? That's right, I've been here before, but this is a little less panicky. Um, no, we're out. The MOG has launched. We are out all ripping on it. The dirt is incredible, so good, and we were just ripping the single track on bikes that it's made for. Are not you hiding bikes. from the wind? Yeah, Jess is helping us hide from the wind. Nice. And Ben was like pushing me, he was like, you're going too slow, you're going too slow, go faster. That's not what I was saying. <laughs> I was like, oh God, we're gonna die. Yeah. 
<laughs> yeah, following these guys is fun until you realize you're in way over your head. Not just with the speed, but like the handling, you know? So he's going A speed, which is hard for me to pedal, but then all of a sudden there's like rocks and gaps appear, and he's like, wait, I'm like, oh. I say things besides so we. The, the problem is you trying to go with it. Correct, <laughs> correct. Yeah. Bye bye, Avery. See ya, I don't know when I'll see you next. If it's alright, I wanna keep it with you all night, all night. Have a good time. Ain't gotta worry cause it's alright. It's alright. It's alright. All night, all night, all night. Don't be shy, don't be shy. We know it's a good day, we have a lunch at 4.30. That is good. Quick rundown. Avery and I woke up. We filmed an epic segment, which you're gonna love. Well, you would have seen it by now. That's true, you've probably already seen it. <laughs> wow. Filmed an epic segment. Came over here, had some damn good avocado toast. A little Mog info se segment. And then went out to ride bikes. We were bikes for about 50 miles, got burritos, and then tonight we're having dinner, made by Jess Sarah. Sweet. Hello and good morning. We are out here on extremely sunny Catalina Island. Wait, no we're not. We're in San Diego. Okay, this is my Envy Mog. But we're not in San Diego. I know, I'm gonna keep going. Oh, okay. <laughs> I know we're not in San Diego. I have another hat. We're actually in Boulder. Welcome to my Envy Mog. Willie's over there. Oh my goodness, your speed! You are pure speed! This is my all new Envy Mog. This bike has some special features, most of which are to do with tire clearance. You can run 50 millimeter tires, front and rear. It's bigger than I've ever run in my life on a gravel bike. It is a size medium frame. I have set it up with small flare bar. It's a 40 on the top, 45 in the drops. We're currently running three, four wheels with 160 rotors, XTR pedals, Dura Ace crank with a 5034, and the cassette in the back is 1134. So pretty good gear range. GRX complete, running the Wahoo up front, polar bottles in the cages. Silka is keeping those bottles stuck in there. P.S. If you're wondering why my bike is dirty, it's because Adventure is never clean. Currently running the Kenda Alluvium tires, 40 millimeters, and it looks like this bike is absolutely swallowing them because it has so much clearance. So look for me to run some big boys next year. I also have the Envy Dropper, which has been a great friend for me trying to keep up with Keegan and Russell on the downhills. And ESI Bar Tape, the most comfortable tape in the game. Uh, we have storage in the inside where I like to store a little orange seal bottle and also CO2s and keep them hidden from TSA. Last, but most importantly, this is not just a race bike. This bike also has mounts galore. You can take a fender on the back, you can put a fender on the front, and you can put all the baskets and bags you could ever need. Okay, now back to California. Guac, mango salsa, queso fresco, uh, jicama, cabbage slaw, some stewed black beans, some Street corn and margaritas and lots of drinks. <laughs> 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 what is this filming? Bye bye, Avery. <laughs> <laughs>